Hi everyone, thank you for looking at this electricity lab. You're going to be drawing electric field lines for this lab. You're going to need a clear plastic container, a 9 volt battery, a voltmeter, two nails, some water, two graphing papers, some tape, and two alligator clips. What you're going to be doing for this lab is you're going to be drawing electric field lines. So we're going to have graphing paper that's numbered on the x-axis and the y-axis. Once you number it, you're going to put that graphing paper underneath the clear container. With the other graphing paper, make sure to also number on the x and y-axis. You're going to number that and then you're going to be putting on this sheet the electric field lines, how it's going to look like. So first, you're going to set up that the nail is on the plastic container. You could either set up how I'm doing it now or just tape it to the side of the container. Make sure that if you're going to be taping it, this is going to be underwater. So make sure that the tape is sturdy. You might want to use other kinds of tape if necessary. Then you're going to use the alligator clips to, pop, to connect the positive and negative charges onto the nail. Once you've done that, you're going to add about one to two centimeters of water into the container. And then you're going to get your voltmeter and put the negative wire onto the negative part of the battery and the positive you should just play around with it and see that there's going to be different charges at different parts of the water now what you're going to do is you're going to start mapping out your electric field lines first you're going to start out with where the positive nail is and the negative nail and you're going to put that on the graphing paper and then you're going to look for certain charges so you're going to look for one charge it could be any number but right now i'm just doing it with seven volts and you're going to find six different spots with seven volts. You're going to do this with six, five different charges for any kind of charge. So the second charge that I'm using is three volts, but you could do whatever number you want, 2.5, 1.2, 4, whatever number you want. But I'm just finding six spots where there's three volts. So I'm going to do that. And you're going to be doing this for five different kinds of charges. Once you do that, you're going to line up all of these charges just roughly. So you're just going to line them up and they should make some kind of a shape that you're familiar with. And afterwards, you're going to make electric field lines. These electric field lines, you're just going to be roughly drawing them, but they should pretty much be going perpendicular to the lines of the equipotential lines or the lines of the charges. So you're going to draw this out. And then, of course, you're going to draw out the arrows. The positive should be going to the negative. So you're just going to be drawing it out like that. Then you're going to finish, and you're going to have a nice drawing of an electric field lines. All right, enjoy.